I'm losing it. Ah. This one sounds so good.
Let's go. Hello. It is. It is not. It is the fuck. It is the end of the day. It's like 8:30. Today I did my makeup because I filmed my reaction. I filmed two reactions. I filmed my reaction to. Uh, Do It Like That by TXT and the Jonas Brothers and um, I was filming my reaction to Super Shy which by New Jean which was filmed in Portugal so it was a day full filled with evidence I actually I said that kind of sarcastically but it is true I was very happy when I, I saw the two music videos so that's that July it's it's the 7th of July so we're a week into July which is more than half of like the year gone and um i don't know how i feel about this year technically like it's not been a bad year per se i don't think anything like happened and that's the problem <laughs> nothing happened there's still a lot of stuff that i want to do and be able to achieve i don't know if i'm going to be able to make it this year but um i'm still doing it so six months is a lot of time to do stuff no need to be like panicking and stressing out because oh my god i have no time like i have time but it's a nice reminder to see like which goals I set for myself, what goals I set for myself and what goals I haven't been paying attention to at all. Uh, this, I made a video, uh, I think it was either January or February, I don't remember, talking about my vision board and just like going in depth into that. So you can watch that video if you want to. We have the tattoo. I did get the tattoo. Um, Oh, can you see? Um, I do want to get a lot more tattoos, but right now no money means nothing gets done, nothing gets bought. I feel like that's definitely one of those goals that is heavily dependent on other like circumstances. I can just, you know, walk up to a tattoo like parlor or artist and be like, the tattoo for free? Like I can do that shit. Um, so it really heavily depends on me having money, which I currently do not have. And we have the room, um, like um room redo no room transformation i'll call it a room transformation right? obviously i still haven't done it my room is like um i don't like my room like i don't hate hate my room because obviously if i hated it i feel like i wouldn't spend as much time in it as i do but at the same time i feel like it's it's something that you can guess guess to uh, get used to even if you hate um but the, the, my room if i had like you know the possibility to i would change it like a hundred percent but once again it's something that is dependent on money i would say like i, I don't want to hold my breath but it's still getting done this year then um we have the relationship part which holy shit <laughs> that is not going just like anywhere no relationships in sight no new friendships or anything i recently saw i think it was um, very random but i think it was like a reddit reading like stories with like on smosh and i think shane said something about like if you want like relationships like in your early 20s you shouldn't seek like actually romantic relationships you should seek friends and then like after that you get like you maybe you fall in love with a friend or you get like to meet a friend of a friend of a friend and stuff like that you shouldn't go intentionally seeking like a loving like a love relationship because it can go wrong a lot of the time it can come off wrong so like uh, but at the same time i also don't have any like new friends or places to meet any new friends i'm starting to see some like events now that i have my like car back there are some events that i was interested in going but they actually happened before like i i completely forgot to check the like the website for events and now they're like gone but they were like book uh presentations and that is something that interests me so I would have liked to have gone, but I did not, and I'm upset because I, I completely forgot to check the fucking website. Like that didn't. I, I have everything in an app, so now every time I have to check a website for updates, my brain just like completely forgets about it. Money making money. Uh, I just told you guys I'm not making money, so that one is a work in progress. Uh, I've um, studied like. I've tried to study every single day via Duolingo. I haven't done it every single day. Some days I skip, some days I don't. But it's been slightly maintained. Um, the YouTube stuff I have been doing YouTube a lot more often, at least on this channel. So that's that. Yeah, like the, the, with the YouTube is kind of complicated to see progress when your actual channel isn't uh, making that much progress. Progress, if you know what I mean. Uh, when it comes to reading, I have done that. I need to take more aesthetic like 
book pictures though <laughs> i need i want to redo my room so bad because i want to have like an aesthetic like um not even an aesthetic i just want to have a desk space that's just for me so that i can you know i want a desk that's all i want then we have the, the concert part obviously in september i'm going to see five seconds of summer which i'm really really excited also um like some of my friends got the the link not the link the code to go see taylor swift i don't know if i want to like like i said no money i don't know if i want to go and spend the money but like the, technically the concert is only next year and i could make that money back yeah there's definitely a lot of stuff that i could be doing more like the gaming part i haven't done um the like braga trip happened so that's done and then um this like traveling more i don't know if i'm gonna be able to do it this year like i said depends on money and yeah but besides this like i'm still excited um it's i'm in the like, position where um my mentality is going off like six months have passed six months six months of this year have passed but at the same time you still have six months like to do whatever the fuck you want to do also hoping everything goes well like your life doesn't end after the first of january i mean for some people it doesn't that's really that but you know you know what i mean right um some people think that like you set your goals on the first of january and then if you don't do them by the end of the year that's like that's it you don't get another chance that's not true um by the next january you can just like set out that same goal and continue making progress towards that and that's what i'm kind of like trying to do so we'll see obviously by the end of the year or like maybe uh, uh early next year which is gonna it's gonna be 2024 i don't know if this is gonna be the last clip of the video because the fact that i've been filming for 15 minutes and i'm gonna have to cut this down immensely but we'll see if it is thank you guys so much for watching this video thank you so much uh, for everyone who's been watching my vlogs i know they're a little bit tough to watch sometimes because they're a little bit boring but bear with me <laughs> and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys the next time you decide to watch another one of my videos bye bye this bracelet by the way is the yenjun bracelet this was just like a random one